The number of coronavirus cases in our state is nearing 137,000. And other key numbers we're watching are trending now in the wrong direction. Welcome to the News at 11. I'm Rick Renner. And I'm Vic Carter. This news comes as the worldwide race is on to find a vaccine for this virus. And even though we're likely still months away from having a vaccine, Maryland does have a plan for when one is finally approved. WJC is live right now. Kelsey Kushner explains patients will be given top priority before the general public. Kelsey. Well, Rick and Vic, this is a two phase plan, and the priority really is on the people who are living in the nursing homes and people who are working on the front lines. The state says that they want to make sure people who are most at risk are protected. In anticipation of a COVID 19 vaccine, Maryland unveiled a draft of its mass vaccination plan. Tuesday, Governor Hogan announced the draft plan that breaks down into two phases and focuses on availability and distribution once a vaccine is approved. The Maryland Department of Health says phase one of the plan focuses on priority groups, including frontline workers, people in assisted living facilities, and essential workers. Phase two will then open the vaccine to the general public depending on availability and supply. Kurt C. With the state health department says it's a plan they've been working on since April. To make sure that we would uh, have a, a plan that would be able to vaccinate uh, all of, of Maryland who wants to be vaccinated. The draft, based on information from the CDC, lists a number of components that go into making it a smooth process, like recruiting providers, inventory management, storage of the vaccine, and safety monitoring. But some are calling the plan into question. A lot of these things are not. Uh, have not been thought through completely. Michael Greenberger with the University of Maryland Center for Health and Homeland Security says it won't be easy to store and distribute the vaccine to everyone who wants it. It's complicated by the fact that uh, individuals will need two deliveries of the vaccine, two injections, and there needs to be money to support all this. Now, of course, the state health department says that this plan is not concrete. It will change over time, especially with new developments with the vaccine. They say, although there is no official vaccine that is out yet, they want it to be transparent with the public and release their plan early. Reporting live tonight, Kelsey Kushner for WJC.